Hey there, Mark Warnkin here, your social media for business specialist. And in this video, I'm going to show everyone how to create a poll or to create a survey on Twitter. So here we are on my Twitter profile, Mark Warnkin. And if you aren't yet following me on Twitter, by all means, do so and stay up to date with everything social media for business. So you can actually create a poll on Twitter via the desktop version and via mobile version. And I'm going to show you how to do it on both of them. This is the desktop version. So very simple to get started. Firstly, we click the blue button that says tweet. And it's then going to open up the options that we can do. And it's the middle one here that we want to then select. It's when we select that, it's going to bring up the options to create a poll. So the first thing we need to do is to ask a question. So what's the question I'm going to be asking? So the question that I'm going to be asking on this poll is video content on social media is booming. If you're still not creating any, what's the main reason? There we go. Very topical because, uh, as I said, social media is... Um, very, uh, sorry, not social media, video content on social media is absolutely booming. Now we need to give people answers that they can actually vote on. So the first one I am going to select is don't know how to. Second option, now how many options you can, you can actually create four particular options. So um, that's a common question people ask, how many answers can you have? So I'm gonna create four answers. First one is don't know how to. Second one is, um, and I hear this one all the time, is don't have a camera. And most of us have a phone these days, so I don't know why people um, come up with that as an excuse. And the other two answers I've put in is don't have any ideas and fear is stopping me. Okay, how long do we want to let the poll run for? Look, I reckon three days is more than enough to get some instant feedback from the Twitter community, not only your followers, but potentially people around the world. And it is that simple. Let's click tweet. And you watch the magic starts happening because my tweet is now gone live and this is how it will appear for the twitter universe to start clicking on their option or their voting on my poll video content on social media is booming if you're still not creating anyone any what's the main reason don't know how to don't have a camera don't have any ideas fear is stopping me and people can get to like and comment and and you know retweet that and have lots of fun with it so that's how you do it on desktop let me show you how to do it on mobile version or i'm actually going to show you live on my ipad so here we are again on Twitter, this time coming to you from my iPad and it makes sense to show it to you on iPad and mobile because the vast majority of people do consume Twitter via mobile or the iPad device. So as you can see at the top here, that was the, um, the tweet that I did via the desktop version. Um, we're now going to replicate that via my iPad or mobile. How do we do that? Bottom left, we can see the plus in the, in the blue Twitter icon. We tap on that similar type of screen. It's the middle button here again, where we get to um, select a poll and then we're gonna ask that same question. Now that same question again is video content on social media is booming. If you're still not creating any, what's the main reason? And choice number one was don't know how to. Choice number two was don't have a camera. Choice number three was don't have any ideas. And option number four, or choice number four, fear is stopping me. Poll length, um, last time we created three days. Look, I honestly believe you can go as long as seven days, but gee, after a couple of days, I think that's more than enough to get some feedback. Um, and that's again, that's how simple it is. Three hours, one question, sorry, three days, one question, four options for polling going three days, and we would press tweet. Your tweet was sent, and there we go. We now have two of them going, so I will delete the one of them and just let one of them run and look out for a follow-up video and I will actually give you the um, 
the vote of that, or maybe not a video, I will actually update it on Twitter. So there we go, that's how simple and easy it is to create a poll on Twitter via the desktop version and via uh, mobile or iPad. Um, if you're watching this on my YouTube channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. If you're finding it on Facebook, give me a thumbs up and a like. You might also be seeing it on LinkedIn and Twitter as well. Mark Warnkin, Social Media Selling 123 signing off. I look forward to seeing you again in another one of my videos real soon.